play the victim. Like, what the fuck is up with people? Let me see what's on right now. Hold on, guys. Congratulations, Collective. Your chakras are now <laughs> realigned and rebalanced, okay? <laughs> but um, now it's like your spiritual... Um, the next thing that's on is um, spiritual energy unleashed, okay? So it's unleashing your spiritual energy, all right? It's like, you know, activating it or whatever. All right. They're, so now somebody wants to come and align with you, okay? They want to um, realign. They, they're they're having a higher. They're they're looking at it like they're having like a um. They're looking at it in a different light or whatever. It's still like you know whatever, but whatever. They're trying to align with you now. Cause they figure, all right, well, um, they realize that duh, they're on the wrong side, the wrong team. They should have been on your side, and they would have made out a lot better being on your side and. <laughs> confirmation um that's just fucking obvious um but yeah they now want to align with you because they know you're getting <gasps> they um, excuse me they know that you're you're getting some sort of jackpot future some sort of like i mean fortune or like reward they're also hoping that you'll give them some sort of reward for bringing this truth and clarity and they know that you're getting it either way but they need help okay this person needs help their house, their home could be in collections, okay? Or kid, they might not even own a home. They could run it. And they just, they're, maybe they're getting evicted or whatever this is. Also, this isn't for everybody, but this is for somebody. Somebody, all right, they stole your inheritance. There was a house left to you. It could be your family or someone you consider to be family. They have to get out of this house, all right? So they're really going to be asking you because I feel like you were left a lot of money and a home. This person is finally getting some sort of act right, and they're actually going to come forward and tell you because they know they're caught. They know how much money was left to you. They're going to ask you for this house. They're going to be like, well, well, collective, you have all this money. Well, don't you think that like you can just let me and my family still live in this home? Are you fucking kidding me? How about, you know, I give you the money back, but you could let me keep the home. Do you think, by the way, you can pay the bills for, like, the, 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 the utilities, da, 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 Or you think that, like, I, I could stay in a room? You think you could, like, you know, let me live in, in the room, like, one of the rooms? Something like that. They could have children. They know your heart. They know you'll probably say yeah if they have kids. Because I feel like it's a lot of money that was left to you. Like shit, I mean. I would let that shit happen. I wouldn't even want that fucking house no more. I'll be like, bitch, you just have that house. Give me that fucking money back. And, you know, go fuck yourself. Karma's gonna get you. <laughs> or at least let the kids live there. You know what I mean? Without a doubt. What the fuck? Okay, so somebody, this isn't for everybody either, but there is somebody, I should, I'm going to do a separate reading for this, for that, okay? Because this is a whole, I'm going to do a separate reading for that, okay? Should I do a separate reading for that one? Yeah, I'll do that in my next reading. Because we already got, like, so we're so far in, yeah. Fate. This is fated to happen. You could be a reader or they went to a reader and they found out. They could have got a reading done and found out that they're caught up and that you're, you're, you know, you're getting the success. There was also, they were bribing people. Okay, somebody, this isn't for everybody, but, but somebody, this is for somebody. Somebody is a, is a reader. Somebody has a platform. They were bribing people, your family. Or your family was bribed, um, and other people too were bribed to to come up against you on your channel, and 
you know, um, and leave nasty ass comments uh, about you and to try to cause you some sort of problems. They're not doing this no more. They don't want to do this no more because they realize like you are very successful at whatever this is. And even if you don't see it yet, you're going to be. They know it's fated for you to, to have greatness. Okay. You're going to get some sort of major luck and fortune coming through your, your, your channel, you know, and maybe you're just a channel or whatever this is. Um, now I'm strongly getting like that child thing, that the child that was come once coming again against you now they're because they were bribed to or they had some sort of resentment for whatever dumbass reason um maybe they're just brainwashed i don't fucking know but they are now wanting to align with you this the, that with the for that part because they see that your channel is going to be extremely or it is extremely successful so now they're switching sides they don't want to do that now also for like besides that they're um even if you don't have a kid, like for other ones, they were having other people come up against you. They don't want to do it because they realize every time they're attacking you, they're also trying to steal your gifts from you. They're trying to rob you of your gifts, whatever. It doesn't matter. It's not going to happen. Now, the other people like that they were once paying to come up against you and leave nasty ass comments on you and to try to like, you know, discredit you within them doing this, right? They're watching your channel and they're starting to see, oh shit, no, the person that was bribing them, they're watching your channels. They see that you are extremely tapped in that the, and it's exposing them of what these people have been doing. So these people don't want to take these bribes no more. And they're realizing um, maybe you're even speaking about what these people have been doing to the people that they were ripped. Because if they're doing this to you, an innocent person, of course, the people that they're bribing, they were, they're doing shit like that to them as well. And I feel like you're exposing that. So these people don't want to take these bribes anymore. And not only that, they're getting bad karma for doing this. So whatever they've been doing to you, it's happening to them. Death. Somebody's fated for death. For what they've been doing to you. They're trying to also end your your career. They're trying to end your your readings, like your or your your I mean your um uh, maybe your readings, but your um your gifts as well. That's not happening. Yeah, your bitchy ass friends that were coaching, they're coaching your friends, or your friend was they're now they're now they once were coming up against you, your bitchy ass friends or they're coaching other people. Now they're here taking notes from you because they know they're on their fucking deathbed and they know that they're about to go down. They're trying to end it. They're trying to end your... You could be a, like... You're coaching people. And you're, you're not just reading. You're also helping people. You're coaching them. Like how to do things in the right way. And like... You know... How to better themselves. Now these fucking schweirdos... Are now taking notes from you. So they're stupid. You would think... Alright... This is what I don't understand. Like the karmic people to be over here like karmican. And they, they hate on you, right? They hate your readings. But yet, like... They sit there and they take notes from you. They Like you would think that they would want you... You know, to be here. Because they get information from you. So why would they be attacking your platform when... Which makes no sense. Because they're religiously watching every single um, reading that you post. And they're getting info. So they are like, it's, you know, in a way it's helping them because they know what's about to happen. Because they're watching your channel. So be like, it don't even make sense. So maybe they don't want to like take these bribes anymore to, um, to attack you because they actually need you. you know, your readings are helpful to them. Like, because they don't have the spiritual insight to see what's coming, you know, in store for them. So I'm strongly getting there's people that were once against you. Now they're not coming against you because they need you. They're, they're religiously, like, they're watching your every single video you post and they're getting updates. They're seeing what's going on. And they're also discovering the snakes that are around them as well. So people that were against you are now coming, like, are aligning with you. And somebody is fated for death. Somebody's, I'm telling you, somebody's passing away and they know it. They could have even got a reading done finding out that they're going to pass away or they got like, you know, and I'm telling you someone's losing that somebody has like Alzheimer's or something or something's happening like they maybe they got into a huge fight or something or they could have like a, um, an illness or they could have overdosed and they could be in like a vegetable state or something like that's happening. And there's also another reader, okay, there's a karmic reader, or there's a, well, you're karmic if you're doing it, so obviously, there's a reader that's jealous of you, okay, of your readings, 
because of how you how you read the attention you get and what's crazy is i strongly feel like this reader has so many more followers than you maybe you're newer to this or they're just like you know whatever the situation is and they've been attacking you they've been attacking your channel but they don't realize you know you're 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 one million percent authentic and, and you're here you're sent here to do this. this is your purpose you were sent here to do this okay so um now their channel is going under okay they're like losing their channel um they're like either like not being monetized or they're like all of a sudden their their followers are stop watching they're either going to like stop they're going to unsubscribe to them or they're going to just like leave their channel and you know come see your channel like they're watching your channel like whatever they're attacking is not smart to do guys like we, first of all we're supposed to be like a family okay we're supposed to be we're like pretty much like a family we're and we you know we help each other like i this person is a very jealous and envious person okay and it's crazy because you they have way more and who cares about the number like i tell you guys all the time i have the best subscribers in the world um and ever um I absolutely love you guys and appreciate it and adore each and every single one of you, even the fucking karmics. Fuck y'all. I don't care. Um, thank you for the views. Thank you for the, um, you know, subscribes or whatever. All right. Thank you for the hate, whatever, because all that hate does is just, you know, it, it brings, you know, it brings me peace and love because it, I transmute that shit. Okay. And it's, you know what I mean? Whatever. It doesn't even matter to me. It doesn't affect me. Okay. But, um, yeah, they know that you're going to be very successful in this. So they're attacking you. Da -da -da -da. All they're doing is attacking their own platform. And now, like, if they're watching your channel, right, now say, say, all right, they, they, they obviously, this is why I'm strongly getting, it's a karmic reader. They're not, they don't really understand how these readings work. You're supposed to be, especially if, okay, so now, let's see, especially like, all right, say this is a reader, this is a reader. There's two different readers here, right? Now, say you, your subscribers, your, your subscribers are, um, are, like you have some subscribers that watch your channel and also watches this person's channel okay so obviously your ancestors okay are going to be speaking to both of you so you are going to be getting similar messages now whatever this person didn't didn't speak about okay they're going to also if they don't they're not picking up the message they're going to come give it to you because their subscribers are also watching your channel and like either they're just stealing your work or they're saying that you're stealing from them, but they don't realize how this actually works. You're going to be picking up free. Like this is how it works. And like this person's just jealous though. I feel like they, maybe they do know that, but they're just jealous and envious and they just don't want people. They're like the haters that like, they won't speak about other readers. Like, you know how like I stay be like, you know, go check out, you know, intuitive Kev, go check out, subscribe there, you know, to him, go just, um, subscribe to, you know, um, what do you call it? Uh, uh, Mystic Nine. Go subscribe to. Yeah, you're supposed to be doing it. You're supposed to be spreading love, okay? You know, and for like a, a, a actual reader that's doing, that's in their purpose, that's doing it the right way, they're gonna want you. Like, it's not about your subscribers. It's not. It's supposed to be about that. First of all, it's not your your channel's not gonna grow if if you know the way it's supposed to be. If you're in that type of envious and energy, all right. You should be doing this to help people, okay? And that's how I do. I do it to help people. So this is why, like, I I constantly give out like other suggestions to other subscribe like to other um to other readers because i want you to find the reader for you you know what i mean i want you to find and i don't care if like somebody is taking my you know what i mean i don't care if like they take my information and they go and they go with it do it okay but at least you're getting the word out there you know what i'm saying like it doesn't matter to me like i'm not a hater like that's a fucking this person's a hater they're, they're, and I'm strongly getting this person even watches your channel, takes your shit, and then goes and says, like, you know what I mean? Which is fucking weird. Which, I mean, it is what it is. Whatever. At least you're getting the message out there, okay? Because it needs to be out there. But they're not fully understanding that this is how it works. Like, especially, so yeah, we're, we're all connected to source, to God, okay? We're getting the messages, well, at least the, the light workers are. We're getting the messages from God. We're all supposed to be getting similar, especially if we have the same subscribers. You're going to get similar messages. And what one person doesn't pick up, the other person will. And that's crazy because um, Intuitive Goddess 333, she was just speaking about this. Because I, I just had, a, like, I've seen her in my, in my third eye. That reading she just did the other day talking about this.
oh and guys be careful too because she has somebody that's 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 pretending to be her it's like intuitive goddess 333 um dash h or like f h uh one tm i think it was that's pretending to be her asking for like what's happening it's not her okay do not and guys anybody that says like that that pretends to be a reader and they say that like and it has the same picture as her too it's not her she doesn't ever ask for um for donations or anything it's not her okay do not get scammed and any readers they this is like what people do the scammers will do they'll go in they'll copy our 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 name but they'll add like something at the end or they'll add something so pay attention to to um and any reader that you do that you watch make sure you pay attention and make sure it's the actual um the reader and it doesn't have like a dash at the end or error like the spelling is correct because they'll, they'll they'll misspell it and they'll take the same picture and everything else and they're going to ask you they'll say oh so, um you know donate to whatever this is yeah no it's bullshit and it, it says something about a whatsapp first of all if they're asking with a whatsapp it's it's a scam be very mindful of that somebody could be trying to scam you somebody could be acting like they could be doing this to you okay and i feel like it's another fucking reader that's doing it confirmation but yeah don't get scammed okay guys into but with the whole intuitive goddess 333 because that person hit me up all right they hit me up trying to say that they were they were they were her and i know it's not her i know how i know it's not her um and she doesn't ever ask for like anything she doesn't she's a very humble person okay and it's 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 a scam and they do it to a lot of readers they're also doing it to like you know a lot of people all right so don't get scammed and just so you know i don't do personal readings i don't even check my emails and um what do you call it i don't i will never ever ask anybody ever ever for no shit like that okay ever um, and I would never hit you up asking for, like, sell it, saying I feel guided to do a reading or whatever, don't get scammed, okay? And, you know, no actual reader is going to do that to you. So, if any reader, you get a message saying, oh, I feel guided to, no, they're fucking full of shit. They're full of shit. They are so full of shit. Do not, especially if it has anything to do with a WhatsApp, okay? Don't, it's a scam. We have alliance, marriage, gain, and accident. Now, your family was aligning with an ex of yours or a couple or like a married couple. Or, like I said, it's not that it's not their Your family was um, was aligning with an ex of yours or a couple to come up against you to try to gain some sort of good luck and fortune. Now they're in danger. You've been liberated. They're trying to cause you to have some sort of danger. You've been liberated. Somebody might even somebody was um, paid to put something in your food or your drink. It was supposed to cause some sort of accident. Maybe they were trying to take your memory, your sight, or something like that. It was maybe have you overdose or something like that. Somebody could have even tried to put something in your room while you were sleeping or your house. They would have had a curse on it. They have you bound to um, accidents and, and stuff like that. Yeah, no. Now this person doesn't want to take this bribe no more because they're the ones that's going through danger. You try them through whatever this is. Get rid of it is what I just heard. You need to get rid of something. Somebody could have gifted you something. It had an attachment to it. Get rid of it. All right. If, if whatever it is just comes to your mind is probably the first thing that came to your mind is probably what it is. What you want to do is get sage first. Foremost, don't just get rid of the thing because you don't want to curse somebody else. What you want to do is you want to get sage or payload santa stick. Sage it. Remove, um, set the intention to remove any spells, hexes, curses, voodoo, hoodoo, which, whatever, witchcraft, whatever it is. Anything negative, evil, anything ill-intentioned or anything demonic that may or may not be attached to the, to the, whatever it is. Okay, and then you want to sage it really good or, or payload santa stick it, you know, really good. All right, now get, um, depending on how big this item is, whatever it is, you know, get duct tape or whatever or, um, if it's like a, a piece of jewelry, if it's a coin, if it's whatever it is, okay, you want to um, cleanse it really good. Then get, if you, depending on like how big the thing, if it's a bicycle or something, then you know what I mean? Like what the fuck, you can't really duct tape that shit shut. All right, but really cleanse it and get rid of it. Um, but then if it's something that where you can get duct tape or like what I use was um, 
Gorilla Tape. The duct tape is Gorilla Tape. It's black, and this way it keeps the it, the, the black, you know what I mean? It helps protect it from anything negative getting out of it. Duct tape that shit up, okay? Then sage it again. Get rid of it, and, and not on your property. You can bury it somewhere, so you can put it in a body of water, um, or you can, you know, just throw it in a dumpster, but don't but don't get rid of it on your property, okay? They're pissed off. Fury, offense, madness, unpleasantness. Yeah, they're pissed because they couldn't cause whatever this is. You're just too protected. You've been liberated from this. They're stressed out now because they're bound to whatever this is. Val. Trap. They're stressed out. Your family or this family is stressed the fuck out because they vowed to darkness to something very dark. They aligned with this couple this could be an ex of yours. It could be your fucking dumbass neighbors. It could be anybody. All right. Um, there's evidence of this. It was all a trap. They vowed to something dark to come up against you. They were they were bribed some good amount of money or something um, to steal from you to cause you some sort of danger, accidents, and now they're the ones. It was all a trap. And again, the authorities are watching this. And and if this is your child, they're in big fucking trouble. They're in huge. They're in big, big, big trouble for this. Your child's in trouble too. Because they were doing something. I'm telling you right now. I'm not even going to say what I'm getting. Because the authorities already know. And this motherfucker's going down. This might make you. When you find some shit out. this You might put your hands on somebody in court. And, I, and this is something I will say. Do it. I don't give a fuck. Do it. If, if what I'm picking up on. You're going to want to do it. They're trying to schedule some sort of trap for you and they got themselves trapped the fuck up. One of these idiots going to realize you're too protected. One of these idiots going to realize that, um, you know, they're cursing themselves and their own family. One of these idiots going to realize you are not one to be fucked with. Oh, oh, wait, where's that death card at? When it's too late, right? Is that when? When it's too fucking late? You're fucking dumb. Your kid could be worshipping something in the dark or some shit. Or your family. You could come from a family of darkness. I just heard. The fuck? You are the light in the family. Conflict. <laughs> Now they're fighting. They're fighting with. They're they're fighting the darkness. The same demons they sent out to you. So now, of course, they're going to want to align with you because they know that you can rebuke this shit. They know you can get rid of this darkness. But these fucking idiots need to stop. They need to repent. The word is called repent, and stop with the fuck shit. Somebody has an has a entity attachment to them without a doubt. Without a doubt. And they know you can cast this entity out of them. But they would have to stop attacking you and stop fucking around with these fucking idiots and the darkness. Or else it's going to continue to consume them. And it's going to get worse. Somebody's moving. Somebody's going to be moving. They want to withdraw now. Because they realize they're the ones bound to it. They realize you try them through whatever fuck boy, fuck boy, fuck girl shit these idiots try to, to throw at your way. These people are dumb, yo. I swear. Yo, these motherfuckers are just so dumb. And there's just so much evidence against these idiots. Your dumbass ass friends. Frenemies. They're not friends. They're frenemies. You ain't a friend of me. He's a friend of me. And there's evidence of them working with a child. I'm telling you right now. Somebody needs to quit smoking. Oh shit. 
I know, spirit, I'm working on it. <laughs> or maybe you did quit smoking. I know, I know, working under you. You're going to try on through that, though, okay? Whoever's, like, trying to quit smoking or whatever, you're going to you're gonna get a victory. You're going to. It's a work in progress, you see. <sighs> You're going to gain when you do, too. Somebody, uh, quit smoking, okay? You're going to gain something, alright? Once you liberate the cigarette smoking habit or whatever. Or vaping. I know, it's very bad, I know. You're going to triumph, though. And I don't know, God has some sort of reservation for you. Um, when you quit this, when you give up these cigarettes or vapes or something. As I'm taking a drag of this fucking vape right now. <laughs> But they're starting to awaken to the fact that um, every time they send in an attack to you, you try them through it, and they're the ones that are being bound to it. Because they're attacking themselves, not you. You are too protected. Also, something about somebody buying children, their children, or your children, or somebody, or children, and um, alcohol, too. They're fucking in trouble for that, too. Or, or some shit like that. This is, like, I think that family that, like, that, that, that mom that was, like, I feel like that's the one to put her, her child up for, um, for a sacrifice as well. Or the father. Or something like that. That, like, they're having, like, the mom was having her, like, teenage kids, like, sell drugs for her. And she was, like, doing drugs with them and shit. Death. They were coaching somebody to try to trap you into something, some sort of schedule. They were trying to schedule some sort of death for you. Somebody could have been putting something in your cigarette or your vape. Quit. You need to quit. They are trying to coach somebody to do something to like your cigarettes or your vapes or something. They were supposed to cause you some sort of death. But look, this was a death trap for them. They tried it on a live view, right? It was all a death trap for themselves. Because there's evidence of this. Of your friends. Now they want to apologize. For bullying you. Somebody put something in your cigarette or your or your vapes. Maybe that's why you've been getting the nudge to like quit. But God liberated you from that. But still you're still being like urged to quit. Also, there's somebody, there's a karmic person that rolls their cigarettes and their girlfriend, this is like an enemy of yours, the girlfriend's been putting shit into their cigarettes and giving it to them. Because they like roll, they have like a rolling machine or something, they roll their own cigarettes and the girlfriend was putting um, like rat poisoning or something in, in the tobacco and she would go buy cigarettes for herself and give the boyfriend let the boyfriend have, like, she would pretend like she had rolled cigarettes, but she really, you know what I mean? This this couple doesn't spend a lot of time together. They're always, like, when one comes home, because they have a small child, one comes home, the other one leaves, right? So she has her own cigarettes, her own, like, she buys cigarettes. Like, I'm sure I'm getting, like, possibly Newports or something, or, like, some sort of menthol cigarettes. But then she buys tobacco, roll, rolling tobacco, like, you know, and 
she's been poisoning this tobacco. She's been trying to get rid of her boyfriend for a while. She hates him. Because she knows he hates her too. They hate each other. Like, there's something very shady about this relationship. I don't even, like, I don't know what's going on with this. And that child's, like, not even his. It's like his... It's not even, it's not even, like, there's something very weird about that whole, the like, whole thing's like a setup. The whole family's a setup. Thank you, sir. Yay, somebody needs to quit smoking. I know I need to take that same advice. Sweet dreams are made of these. Yeah, they were trying to attack something, like, in your sleep, too. Um, somebody could have came in your fucking room when you were sleeping and, and put something in your cigarettes or your, your tobacco or your vape or something. You're going to get some sort of download in your, in your sleep. You could be a fortune teller. You get a lot of downloads in your dreams. Pay attention to your dreams. These idiots are out here living a nightmare while you're over here having sweet dreams. Somebody was definitely trying to ash project you in your sleep. They're trying to get into you. Like, they're not, they're not allowed in your, in your energy anymore. Stop taking cigarettes from people, too. Because they're putting something in the cigarettes. These motherfuckers are scumbags, dude, for real, some real shit. There's evidence of this, though. They're going to prison. Look, death. They're trying to end your, your dreams and, like, your sweet dreams. They're trying to end whatever gifts that you, you have, too. Somebody's passing away, bro. I'm telling you right now, it's a friend of yours. It might be that woman that's going to be passing away from, like, she poisoned you, too. They poisoned. They both did. They poisoned you um, many times in with cigarettes too, with tobacco, or um, in your food or your drinks. There's evidence of them trying to unalive you, and poisoning you, drugging you, and them trying to get like a kid or a family member to do it to you as well. They're, but they're trying to end your... Um, they're trying to put an ending to your your downloads and your gifts. It's just not happening. <sighs> Fucking losers. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, thank you. We have stubborn on the fence here, more so in the reverse. And fright. They were once being stubborn, but they don't want to be stubborn anymore. Like, there's somebody that's wishy-washy, okay? They're starting to, to, we have fright in the upright. This is like this, on the fence more so in the reverse. But this is telling me somebody that's like, they're stubborn, but they're starting to like lose some of their stubborn. It could be um, your family member, possibly. Or it could be a friend or something. They're scared to death now, this couple. They're 